Correct, Melissa. The Odyssey is overrated. And today we are going to talk about... Megan, Naomi! How many times do I have to tell you to stop talking in class? Sorry, Mr. Furkus. We'll be quiet. I've heard that one before. You're gonna have to separate you two, okay, Megan? Go sit by the window. What? No, please. You heard me. Don't make me ask twice. Say your goodbyes. I don't know how to say goodbye to you. You're all like a sister to me. <laughs> this world is cruel and vast, but our friendship can survive. Here, take this parchment, dear sister. Write me. I will write you. We will be together again someday. All right, let's keep it pushing. Oh, geez. Sorry, excuse me. Okay, let's move on. This week, we're talking about Greek philosophy, okay? Dearest Naomi, I hope this letter finds you well. I am writing to you from across the classroom. Everything is strange, different. I am seated directly beneath a vent. I do so hope I shan't catch a chill for the heathens and mongrels that surround me will likely be of little help. Hey, tall girl, I can't see. Oh, sorry. Oh, I do so miss you, dearest sister, from another mister. Love, Megan. Odysseus couldn't get from Troy all the way to Greece on just his own little flippers. Am I right? <laughs> and Homer knew that. He was blind, but he wasn't. You know, not on a boat. That's what I always say. Anyway. Dearest Megan, your letter filled my heart with both joy and sorrow. How I long for the days where we would laugh together unhindered by the ominous and hateful eye of Mr. Fergus. Part one of the Odyssey is mostly about... Speaking of, have you noticed that he totally has pit stains? Boats. How and bear. Okay. Now. Precious Naomi, I appear to have caught a chill from the harsh climate on this side of the classroom. Although the desk over here does come with a pen nook, However, these things bring me no joy, for I am without you. My cherished friend, Megan. I apologize for not having written in some time. I come bearing delightful news. I have just been asked to spring formal by Jake Patelli. He is kind and he is handsome and he has a trampoline in his backyard. Knowing that you are happy brings me joy. This is a monumental occasion and I shan't miss it. The world may try to keep us apart, but I will find my way to you. If we are to reunite, we must do so under the most secret of circumstances. Tis a risk I'm willing to take, for you are about to embark upon a new life with Jake Patelli. And I must know if he is like cute and stuff, you know? Yes, of course, but tread carefully. The consequences could be far greater than we imagined. Homer's Greek, Plato's Greek. Plato is also a toy. What is not okay, a toy? Okay, he's cute, right? <gasps> Megan, Naomi, detention. I I my pencil! Still got it. Data subscriber, it does appear as though you enjoyed this video. And if that is in fact the case, please be sure to subscribe to our channel. You can also watch more Studio C sketches on the BYU TV app or BYUtv.org.